Wow, what's the sound? What the business is? I already know it's I know the ism. Top to activity business CEO. Y'all know we V'd up and we G'd up. We are at the peak of the hierarchy. We are voluptuaries and gangsters. Believe that. Facts are no fallacy, man. But yeah, I'm outside with it. I'm outside with it, man. Enjoying this beautiful Atlanta weather, you know what I'm saying, before it get too hot. You know what I'm saying? So that's how you got to do it when you... It's getting about that time, y'all, where we got to get up and handle our business for that sun get out, you know? Everybody ain't rolling around under the AC and shit like y'all, you know, some of y'all. Some people got to get up and get at it early so they don't have to deal with that heat, you know what I'm saying? But facts with no fallacy though. It's about that time, y'all. Y'all need to get situated. Y'all gonna be outside hot as fuck this summer, man. That what they were probably scheming on me about. Say fuck it, we gonna keep his ass broke. He gonna he gonna be outside this summer. He gonna see one of them white girls gonna give him a ride. No, nah, bitch. I know how to beat the heat. I'm a real street nigga. So before I ask you or any of your people for a ride, bitch. I will fuck around, sit in the shade somewhere until it cool off, and then I'll go handle my business. Or I'll make so primarily that I got everything I need so I won't even have to go out and, you know what I'm saying, do none of that. Believe that. You know what I'm saying? We coming outside like, you know, 6.30, you know what I'm saying, p.m. You know what I'm saying? Real street niggas, we, unless we really got to be outside, then we really going to figure it out. We going to find some way to be at, even if it's at a fat bitch house. You know what I'm saying? We gonna chill at that big bitch house till later on. You know what I'm saying? Till we can pop out. You know what I'm saying? Y'all be trying to force people to be with y'all and shit. Fuck that shit. But yeah, though, I was about to say, I know y'all heard me get on the bitches last night about being freaky, you know, and not admitting it and being miserable, you know, because they're not open sexually. You know, they're not really willing to let someone, you know what I'm saying, handle their business like that. You know, they want somebody that they really can't, that's really out of their league to slut them out and shit like that. That's what it really, that's what really be going on. These bitches be thinking that they too good for certain niggas. Sometimes I gotta, you know what I'm saying, snap their ass back into reality like, bitch, where's the man at that you got a crush on? Where the fuck I know the ism at? Ask that bitch, man. She be all on my dick. Talking about ism this and ism that. Like, bitch, look. Ism is not here. I'm here right now. Ism will not be here. Ism fuck the sexiest, bossiest bitches. Why the fuck you even trying to compete and compare yourself to these bitches? Like, ask your bitch that, man. Ask the bitch. Like, ask these bitches, like, that y'all know is I'm too good for that's trying to get slutted out. Then let that bitch know, man. Like, stop playing and go on and give me some pussy, man. Like, you're not finna get who you want. He out your league, unless you're gonna step your game up. And some of them bitches, they can step their game up but still not gonna get who they want because they not desired. You know what I'm saying? Facts with no fallacy. Believe that, man. But um, what I was about to say, though, was I'm gonna get on y'all gay niggas, man. Yeah, the homosexuals. Yeah, y'all didn't think I was gonna get on y'all about this shit, huh? Yeah, it's tough love, man. It's tough love. That's 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 really what it is, man. It's tough love. At the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? Y'all still need it on this earth, man. At the end of the day, we still need y'all, man. So fuck all the bullshit, man. But what I am going to talk to y'all about is y'all be around here having these y'all aunties and cousins and sisters and brothers or whoever that don't know y'all gay. Y'all got them thinking y'all finna be making kids and shit like that. I ain't gonna say shit like that. Y'all got them thinking y'all finna be out here starting families and, you know, adding to the legacy and shit like that when y'all gay, man. Why y'all don't tell these people that y'all gay deep down inside, man? I was in Sprouts the other, earlier, and this woman was looking at me. I guess that was her nephew. I don't know if it was her son or her nephew or whoever, but you could tell it was somebody in her family. And she just looked at me like, you know what I'm saying? You need to take him with you and, you know what I'm saying? Y'all go get some women because, you know what I'm saying? We want, we need some babies in the family. You know what I'm saying? I looked at that woman like, you can't tell that that man gay. You know what I'm saying? You can't tell he, like, do y'all, that's a question for y'all women. 
y'all don't be looking at y'all gay cousins and nephews and shit like that, or them boys around there and don't realize, like, man, that boy fruity. Like, that boy gay. Like, you, you don't understand. You don't get that shit. The bitches that he do bring around, he don't flirt with them or smack them on the ass or do nothing to indicate that he fucking the bitch. That's just his female friend. And he be trying to fuck her male friends. That what the fuck he be trying to do. He don't be trying to slut her out. He don't be trying to strike her. He be trying to strike her friend. He be trying to get her other dude friend to come over and shit. Talking about invite him over. Like, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? Y'all don't even be picking up on y'all people be gay and shit. And they be around here molesting the younger boys in the family and all type of shit that be occurring. But y'all don't be thinking about that shit. You know what I'm saying? We got to take this into consideration. Just like I was telling these bitches that they need to just admit how freaky they are, that they want to get trains ran on them, or, you know what I'm saying? Or they want to get tied up, you know what I'm saying? They want to, you know what I'm saying, do a scene like they getting kidnapped and get taken somewhere and get the shit fucked out of them. Like, you know what I'm saying? Whatever fantasy, you know what I'm saying, that's y'all business. But I'm just, I was just using that as an example. What I'm saying is people be doing shit or people be wanting to do shit and never get a chance to do it. And then they get older or some shit and they be mad at the people that's living their life and shit. You know what I'm saying? People be jealous of people's sex lives. You know what I'm saying? They were probably jealous of my sex life. They they secretly watched when I was fucking. If any of y'all see any video of me fucking a bitch, it wasn't because I press record and put that shit out there. Just know that. You know what I'm saying? Some of y'all probably do record shit and put it on Pornhub and shit. I never uploaded no videos on Pornhub. I never wanted to be no porn star. I always keep my, I kept my sexual life secret. You know what I'm saying? So if y'all see ism on any Pornhub or any of that shit, I didn't put it there. Just know that. Believe that. So, um, yeah, like I was saying, though, like, it ain't none of my business. Like, y'all gay niggas do y'all, but when y'all got people... Y'all misleading people and making people think that y'all straight and y'all trying to get some pussy. Y'all trying to start a family when deep down y'all gay. That's fucked up, man. You know what I'm saying? That's that's really fucked up. I'll be hurt. You know what I'm saying? My son will never, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to make sure my son's surrounded by, my son's surrounded by beautiful women. My son's. And they're going to be with me. You know what I'm saying? They're going to be doing masculine activities. And they're going to be around feminine, beautiful, sexy women. You know what I'm saying? That's going to teach, that's going to show him how he should be treated as a man. You know what I'm saying? So it's different. But I was just going to say I would be hurt if I found out, you know what I'm saying, if I'm older. And I'm like, son, when, you know what I'm saying? I'm getting older, you know what I'm saying? I want me a grandson, man. I want me a granddaughter, man. And he just up there like, shit, dad, I'm, you know what I'm saying? When I find the right one, I got you, whoop the whoop, you know what I'm saying? We around here trying to see some, have some little grandbabies running around and shit. The, the, the younger ones getting a little older and shit, you know what I'm saying? My girl's probably already, you know what I'm saying? Well, I don't know, because ain't no telling how they going to be for sure. I know they going to be independent and, on that shit, but I'm not gonna put it in their mind that they don't need no man. You know what I'm saying? I don't give a fuck if they inherit a hundred million dollars. I'd never be like, fuck them. You don't need them. You know what I'm saying? You still gonna need your man. I don't give a fuck if you the wealthiest woman in the world. You still need a man. You know what I'm saying? You still need men. We still need men in this world, and vice versa. I don't give a fuck how many bitches you got. You know what I'm saying? We still, you know, how much money you got, how much you think you don't need a woman, man. We need women. We need each other in this world, man. Believe that. Facts for no fallacy. Mm. But y'all got the, you know what I'm saying? Just like the bitches. Y'all not admitting how freaky y'all are. You know what I'm saying? Y'all not admitting that shit. Y'all secretly turning... Males gay and shit like that. Like, y'all doing a lot of shit behind closed doors. But me, I see through that shit, man. I'm just like, man, why don't y'all just admit that shit? Nigga got to bust y'all red-handedly doing some gay shit for y'all to just say, all right. You know what I'm saying? And y'all still probably deny that shit. Like, that wasn't me. That was somebody else. Nah, bitch. That was you, nigga. That was you. 
on the hit ass shit. Y'all niggas got a these bitches got a bust y'all, and it's even worse because y'all have girlfriends, and then y'all will be around here trying to tell a nigga, tell a bitch, oh don't fuck with him, and you gay, you got a whole girlfriend, you gay, and telling somebody else that somebody blackballed. Now that that don't even make sense. How the fuck you gay, got a girlfriend, and talking about somebody blackballed from getting bitches? Cause you want them to be gay, but you acting like you're not gay when you really are. Man, that shit is absurd, man. That shit is crazy. People, it's people that was married, man. Got a ring on their finger. Got rings on their fingers. Excuse me. Rings on their fingers, and they around here talking about what the fuck I can do and what I can't do with my bitches, or who I can get with and who I can't get with. What the fuck? The shit don't make no sense, man. Factual, no fallacy. But y'all niggas in the same boat as these bitches. Y'all ain't getting no pass, man. And y'all men, supposedly. So y'all definitely need to just man up, man. If you gay, you gay. Just say that shit, man. Don't be around here misleading people, misleading your kids, your mama, your aunties, your uncles, or whoever to make them think that you trying to contribute to the legacy. You know what I'm saying? You trying to contribute to the bloodline. But you around here doing some shit that shouldn't be condoned. You know what I'm saying? But I just wanted to speak on that, man. You know, because that lady really looked at me like he needs some help. You know what I'm saying? But I'm not here to help him. He was, the, he was one of them motherfuckers. He was one of those individuals that was around here saying I was blackballed and trying to turn me gay and shit. So he definitely not getting no help. He definitely not getting no assistance. You know what I'm saying? Facts or no fallacy. Like, it's serious out here, man. It's people I don't even know that's out to get me, man. But fuck it, though. I'm a gangster. I ain't tripping. You know what I'm saying? I'm a gangster. Facts or no fallacy, man. And y'all do not need to be threatening nobody that's talking about helping me or basically coming into a partnership with me, man. Because we helping each other. Believe that, man. So I don't want to hear that shit. Anybody come around here and trying to do business with me, we helping each other. So if you telling somebody, don't fuck with me, and you don't got shit for me or them, you just need to shut the fuck up, man. Mind your business. You definitely need to mind your business, man. Don't be around here playing games, man. This shit's serious, man. This is my mother. This is my life, man. So y'all need to realize that shit. Y'all need to think about that shit. This is my life. It's not yours. I got to live this life that you trying to stop, you trying to prevent from living basically so yeah like i said y'all niggas in the same boat as these bitches man y'all really in the worst of situation you know what i'm saying because y'all supposed to be the men in the world in this world you know what i'm saying y'all supposed to own up to whatever the fuck going on in y'all life man and, and just you know what i'm saying especially to y'all people y'all don't owe no explanation to nobody but y'all family man because they the ones who expect you to contribute and keep the bloodline going, man. You don't got to explain shit to me or none of my niggas or none of my bitches, man. Just set the record straight with your people, man. You know what I'm saying? And y'all freaky bitches who be out here doing all that extra shit, you know what I'm saying? I, I'm with that. Like, I, you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna sound with all the extra shit, but you know what I'm saying? I'm with that freaky shit, you know what I'm saying? I just don't want y'all to be miserable and just thinking that somebody finna slut you out or fuck you that that's really out of your league and you just wasting your time ducking and handling other niggas fucked up because you think they're not good for you, good enough for you, but who you want is not good enough for you. I mean, who you want could feel like you're not good enough for them. So it could be both ways and a lot of us do that shit, man. We be wasting our time trying to go after somebody that we know nine times out of ten we'll never have, man. You know what I'm saying? And we fuck over the people that's right there with us. Just because we feel like they're not good enough, they're not good as them. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, like, factual, no fallacy, though. Like, y'all gay niggas need to, you know what I'm saying? Man the fuck up, man. For real. Y'all need to man up and let these women know, let you, whoever know that's asking you or expecting that shit, I'm gay. I'm not going for that. I'm not trying to make no kids. I'm gay. I'm attracted to other men. That's all you got to say. It might break their heart or whatever, but man, fuck that shit, man. At least you living in your truth. It feels so. That's why I'm telling y'all freaky bitches to just, just admit that shit or whatever to just admit that shit, man. 
factual, no fallacy, man. I ain't saying just admit everything. I ain't saying admit that you committed a murder that they never caught you for or some shit like that. But I'm just saying it's certain shit like that that you just got to put out in the open, man. You know what I'm saying? Facts with no fallacy. Y'all freaky bitches know y'all gonna get dealt with. Believe that. Y'all already know it's Sinodism, top tech activity business CEO. We V'd up and we G'd up. We at the peak of the hierarchy. And um, we going above and beyond expectations, man. You know, facts with no fallacy though. Like, this shit serious, man. But just let them know. Let them know y'all gay, man. Let them know, you know, what the business is. It don't got to be like that. Trust me, they probably been watching you anyway. Like, yeah, I think that nigga gay. They just don't say nothing. You come around me with that shit, I'm going to ask you. I'm going to tell you. Hey, nigga, what you gay? Nigga? What? You do be doing some gay shit? I'm going to ask you about it. What the fuck I supposed to do? Don't say nothing. That's how we get. That's how we do not get to the bottom of stuff. Cause we see shit and don't say nothing. You know what I'm saying? Fuck that shit. If it's meant to be spoken on, I'm gonna say something about it, man. Believe that. But yeah, get at me. I'm gonna get at y'all. Y'all know what the business is, man. Facts, you know, fallacy. Y'all know what's sound. It's sign all the on top tech activity business CEO. Y'all know we gangsters and we belong to where it's. Believe that. Get at me. I'm gonna get at y'all.